Well, here we are. It's finally carburetor time. I've been complaining about it for weeks and months and not quite years because I haven't had it for years. If I had it for years, I'd be complaining about it, but um, it's time. We're ripping this thing apart. I've got a uh, ye old rebuild kit ready to go. I'll tear this thing apart. I have a friend who's going to give me a little assistance who's a bit better at these things than me. But uh, you might also notice that I'm not looking at the camera and you can hear me because I've upgraded the audio quality of the channel. So hopefully, uh, it's doing well and uh, we're gonna have a good time with that. So I'm um, gonna get this carburetor torn off here in a few and uh, get a little rebuild done, get this thing tuned up, maybe set some timing, maybe have a, you know, have a fun time and, you know, make this thing actually run right for once. It looks good, so now it's gotta run good too, right? I mean, you can't have it just, you can't have it just looking good. So you get that torn off, set the camera up on the bench so you can see what we're working with and uh, yeah, see you in a few minutes. Well, it took an embarrassing amount of time to figure out how to get that guy off. It was a little tight in there. Next time we're gonna, you know, move some stuff out of the way. Um, what you doing, little man? You helping? Are you ready to help? Looks like you're ready to uh, just rip and tear there, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. Well, you just be careful. Don't pinch your little fingers, okay? Okay. You like helping with the car? Oh, look at that. Boy's a genius. Boy, is a genius. Okay. So anyway, carbs off, drained of fuel, mostly. I hope we're going to uh, start taking this guy apart here in a minute. We got the carburetor rebuild taken care of. Haven't got any of the settings put together yet, but um, before we get it fired up, I think I'm gonna do a couple last items. You know, I want to I want to pull the valve covers off and just see how those valves look as far as their adjustment. It was done last year, but I'm just not sure if it's stuck. I want to make sure those aren't off. Um, yeah, I'm gonna set some of the uh, settings up on the carburetor, put everything back together, and uh, turn the fuel on and start this thing up. See how it runs. So uh, that's the next step. Golf covers pulled off. A little loosey goosey. Look at the valve spring retainers. One of these things is not like the other. Huh. Well, that's interesting. She's upside down, Nate. Right? Uh, or... I did not notice that so far. Huh. One of those things is not like the other. That's interesting. Alright viewers, what's wrong with this picture? Doo -doo -doo -doo. Yep, you found it. What the hell? Huh. That's an interesting problem. Oh, oh. Let's see, boy. Um, Don't know. No. Is it better if I just.
just ignore this and just full send it? Uh, we're going to ignore this. Okay. You hear that, folks? Nothing to see here. Oh, shit. No, don't say that. Stop. Say it. I should have. We're going to ignore it. I should have. I should have mic'd you up. <laughs> Am I looking for a wand block tomorrow? No, but you're looking for a head. Oh, no. So is my noise coming from this side? <laughs> the problem is, there's a piece that's not there. Oh, that's good. Well, the other problem with that is... Where is it? Yep. Because <laughs> it's not a little piece. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> so there's a chunk. Look inside the valve spring. Okay. I have not seen it yet. Give me a moment. The spring itself? Look inside the spring. Where it would go to the head. Wait a minute. Wait, what? <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> yep. What? <laughs> I don't know. So I'm having to check the other ones. I'm like, wait a second. <laughs> Interesting. I, I don't have an explanation for that. I but I think that's your noise. Could be. So we're just gonna put these back on and pretend I didn't see any of that. Yeah, that's an idea. Well, let's uh, gonna delete the footage and uh, <laughs> here we go. Something not doing. Clear. Okay. 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 No problem. All right, cool. Oh, wait. So, I never reset our screws. That's probably why it's not running. Ah, I thought you did. No, I meant to, and then I didn't. That's 100% of the reason why it's not running. Perfect, perfect. Are we on fire? Yes. Oh. Yeah, no, that's definitely the problem. I never I never turned our air and fuel screws back out. Okay. Good. of the Michigan Buggy Builder Show. We now have a rebuilt carb, ish, and uh, some amount of timing. Timing has been set, maybe set to something it's not supposed to be set to. We'll find out. If it blows up, it's probably not from the timing. I have a feeling it's from something else. So, uh, gonna put a few things, more things together, but uh, appreciate y'all check out the video. If you like what you see here, you know, again, as always, you know, like the video, leave me a comment, let me know what else you think, uh, any other ideas you have for us. But yeah, appreciate you watching the video. Look forward to seeing you in the next one. Thanks.